from me. There's no reason to put up all these walls, man. I honestly don't care if you like anime, manga, or whatever. Making up an imaginary big brother to blame your knowledge on? That's way more embarrassing than being an otaku. <laughs> Plus, you were so embarrassed about being a doting older brother, you hid the fact that you had younger siblings. Who said I was doting? I don't know if you noticed, but the world's on repeat. Everyone else spends every day doing the same things. You're not, but you're still taking the time to cook for your siblings. You're even trying to keep it healthy. And if I'm not mistaken, you're making something different for them every day, aren't you? <sighs> I thought the losers had some crazy ideas. You really are a great brother, aren't you? That's nothing to be embarrassed about. You should hold your head high. But wait. If you don't have a big brother, how did you know about that really old classic anime? What kind of delusion are we dealing with today? Well, FOSMAP is a big electronics chain, isn't it? Which would make this an electronics delusion, I guess. You see an entrance anywhere? Hmm, nope. Don't see one. Then we better start searching for the source of this whole thing. Hey, you there. Blonde-haired punk. Who are you? Excuse me? Did you just call me punk? Who else would I be talking to? Seriously? Do you need your eyes checked? I'm not punk. I don't care. I just want to know what this place looks like to you. Huh? Are you able to see the delusion then? I decided to come home for the first time in a long time. And it seems I've quite the welcome waiting for me. Who exactly are you? And are you getting the general sense of unease in the air? Unease, huh? I don't think I'd even be able to tell you what unease is anymore. Hey, any of you know a woman named Mari Tojo? I'm afraid I don't. Neither do I. Don't look at me. I'm still not a punk. Yamato? <laughs> Sorry about that. I see. Sorry to ask such a strange question. Is she your girlfriend or something? <laughs> I didn't realize you punks were so deeply interested in the love lives of us full-grown adults. What did you just say? I'll be seeing you. Who the hell does he think he is? Was he a deluser? It certainly seemed like he was able to sense the disturbance here. I wonder... So I was with the others a little earlier. We just threw a welcome party. If he's a freedom fighter... That would be remarkably convenient. Follow through on this delusion hunt, and it'll lead us straight to them. Yeah, guess we better not mess around. If it's an electronics delusion, then we should probably be on the lookout for someone who works with them, right? Let's split up and take a look. I'll go check in with Akemi and see if she's found anything. I'll stick with Yoshino. <laughs> not punk.
overwrite the wrong file. You want to know if there's anything I'm concerned about? Anything at all. You know, like whispers of spooky electronics-related rumors you might hear in the back of the store? Hmm. Rumors, huh? Uh, ain't spooky, but there are the ones about old Hahabu. Hahabu? Yeah. Hajime Hahabu. President of a tiny electronics outlet. Been on the verge of bankruptcy for a while now, on account of the economy. His wife left him and took the kid. But when the electronics boom hit, man, did he bounce back in a big way. Even got him his family back. Now that's a turnaround. He's been the talk of the Akihabara electronics industry since it all went down. Thanks for the tip. A reversal of fortune from a sudden electronics boom, huh? Electronics-related rumors, you say? Yeah, like any sudden changes you can think of. Well, certainly. The president of Hahabu Electronics. His is a very suspicious set of circumstances. He's been making quite merry for some time now, saying it's the era of the large household appliance. Of course, given this boom, he may have a point. But still, it's very odd behavior. So, somebody's celebrating the era of the large household appliance. Okay, thanks. What's been on my mind lately, electronics-wise? Anything will do. I mean, Occupus still in the middle of an electronics boom, right? Just as big as ever. True that. <laughs> For a while there, I wasn't sure if it'd stay in electronics mecca or not. How about any electronics rumors? Or, I don't know, tips? Are those things? Hmm. Rumors, huh? 
I mean, I guess there is one thing. There's this one store that was on the verge of bankruptcy. But now that electronics have gotten their second wind... Which store was this? The one right over there. Just between you and me, I hear their president was this close to committing suicide. So a president of an electronics store was saved by the electronics delusion. Phew. Well, I definitely got my fair share of info today. Ah, oh, so 